Onion has better magazines. But, you know, you, you, you guys really don't need to hang around. Yeah, why is everyone here? I think we, we're going to be here. Kidding me? That's kind of you. I like that. Well, with us, you wouldn't have to wait until next week to get the results. Okay, but it is what it is. This guy's like, please, Marie, not now. Never turned down a chance to hit the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, he's like, I'm out. You guys are too much. You all right in there? I don't know. I don't think so. Are you okay? <coughs> Can't even speak. Dr. Del Cavoli will go over the results with you next week. Sorry. <laughs> if you say so. Yeah, what the hell? I see something. But I'm not a doctor, so I don't know what I'm looking at exactly. Most people want to know why they suddenly got rich. If she finds out. That's a great point. How much time they give you? How much time? Weeks only? Are you kidding me? Hoping we could make some real money together. Well, this sucks. I'm in shock. Congratulations, you just left your family. A secondhand Subaru. That's just pointless. Why are we doing this then? You know, we should do something this weekend. I don't think he's in the mood for that. I'm thinking I should go see mommy. That was random. You know, I never did call her. Oh, you didn't call her. You're expecting the, the news from the scan to be bad. I think he already knows. Well, he's being realistic. It doesn't work I like am. that. What do you mean, stay well, positive? Dude, Walter is a scientist. You should expect that. I actually think the news from the scan is going to be good. I hope you're right. We should do something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, sure, we should. No, something I'm in. Something else is like, nah. I enjoyed this. Have you been to the Treasure Cave Museum? Nope. What the hell is that? She's a painter. You've never heard of George O'Keefe? I don't think I have, or maybe. I'd kind of go. Sounds fun. A little culture won't kill you. Besides, you hell yeah. A lot of her paintings look like vaginas. That's awesome, Jesse. Get up. We're going. Uh, uh, I've been busy. Well, what do you mean I've been busy? Calendar. Not that busy. Walter is in a rush. I'm going to a museum in Santa Fe, not like you need to know. Walter is like, what? What are you even talking about? <laughs> this is hilarious. Our methylamine. It's going bad. <laughs> <laughs> what a lie. That will fool him. Come on. All right, all right. Hurry up. Oh, she will be so disappointed if they don't go. But I'll be back before you know it. You can always call if you need me. Um, uh... I'm not sure he's going to his mother. He's going to cook with Jesse. He needed an excuse. And when she's gone, let's see first. <laughs> Here he comes. Is she gone? And there's the RV. He can't believe his eyes. You brought a meth lab to the airport. Yeah, he did. Go, drive, go, go. Yeah, we can't stay here for long. These two just don't get along. They are so different as people. That is why it's so funny. To observe them, especially like this when they're together. And we're back here in the middle of nowhere. What if someone finds you one day? Three entire bags of Funyun? Come on, Walter, don't complain. About something with some protein, maybe? Walter is so disappointed. No, not there. That is our workstation. They are fighting about everything. Okay. They showed us that for a reason. But why? I bet we'll find out. We're cooking again. This is quite a lab you've created. I'm super impressed. I have no idea what any of this is, but it looks so cool. Makes me want to cook. Oh my god, you have a lot of it. Nineteen. How much are we talking about? What's up? $672,000. Each? Each. $672,000. Eat. Let's celebrate! We're having a party! Come on! Yes! This is awesome! We're done cooking. I am not done until this barrel is empty. Let's finish it. Come on, Jesse. We're not ahead of schedule. Because I'm dying. We come back tomorrow. Strap on the sizzle and glass up the rest. Come on! So what do you say, Walter? Separate rooms. Um, yeah, that's a given. But I don't know, I feel like something might go wrong now. Oh. Yep, and there we go. What happened? Jesse, back when I asked you... you gotta be kidding me. Safe place. 
Where did you put them? So what do we do now? Did, did your mother drop you on your head when you were a baby? Okay, we don't have to go there. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, the war now we're fighting again. Unbelievable. Something just had to go wrong. It tastes like bad, huh? Did you have to ask? Was wrong Come on. Thing. That's really cool. I'm trying. Pull this. I am pulling. This is too funny. Oh my god. Okay, we're wasting the water. I think Walter might kill him. Well done. Jesse's a genius. Your wife is not gonna notice one little call. Oh. Maybe she will. Don't underestimate her. All right, look. Just make it, make it snappy. I bet that will backfire as well. Yo, skinny, hey. Can you pick us up? We're in the middle of nowhere. Hurry up. All right, so you're gonna head west on the forty for like what, thirty miles? Can he follow instructions? He better be coming. I'm not sure he will find us though. Be quick, just be like, yo, where are you? It's getting cold. The nights are pretty cold out there. He's on the dirt road. Good, good. Are you sure? The river? Yeah. Have you seen anything? Wait, wait. So far, so good. What river? Yeah, what are you talking about? What do you mean, river? Pete, what the hell river are you talking Aren't you about? listening to him? River. Hey, yo, Pete. Yo, Pete, can you... I told you, that dude is just useless. No, he won't find us. We gotta do something ourselves. Just perfect. This is turning into a survival story. And I'm here for it. I'm trying to. Charge the battery. You think it will work? Maybe it will, I don't know. It has to work. Yeah, otherwise we're done. Okay, now it's getting a bit scary. What would you do? Would you walk? No, I don't know. That's also super risky. Hey. Hey Walter. Mr. White. Are you alive? Don't tell me that you died or passed out. I'll give it a little longer. Just to make sure. <laughs> give it a little longer? <laughs> What is it, Jesse? Blood? I mean, it doesn't spoil. Does it? Okay. I think he realized. Is that no. it? They are exhausted. This better work. Yes. Yes. Oh my god. That feels so good. I don't know why. For some reason. I celebrated too early. As always, this is unbelievable. What is this episode? We have one little high. The rest of it has been bad news. He has given up. He's like, let's just sit here and die. I don't know what to say. This is all a disaster. I deserve this. Why are you saying that? First off, everything you did, you did for your family. Don't talk like this. I'm walking. You can come or not. How about he stays here and maybe you find someone? Marching out there, and within an hour, he will be dead. Even worse, he'll be dead. You need to cut out all your loser crybaby crap right now and think of something scientific. Walter, Jesse's about to slap you. I don't think Walter can think clearly. How about you take some of these chemicals and mix up some, some rocket fuel? Yeah, how about it? A signal flare. Am I being too optimistic here? Do you have any money? James, Do you? Coin. Yeah, I got a bunch of them. We have some coins. Bring me brake pads. Bring whatever you can find. What are we building? Yeah, what are we doing? Out of yourself. A robot. Nah, come on. A battery. Put the lid on. Wait. <laughs> this better work. Let's see. But I'm not gonna celebrate. Damn. That is good. Until we're completely sure. This is the scary part. Let's wait a moment. I think... No, I don't want to say it. We made it. Whatever happens, your family will get your share. Jesse, you're a good guy. You have a big heart. Wow, what a freaking episode. It's a tough one, especially from Walter's perspective. Well, I have your scan results. And here we go. Yeah, and you're showing signs of remission. What do you mean? To classify something what? Like as in remission, we only need to determine that the tumor hasn't grown. This is giving me goosebumps. Walt, your tumor has shrunk by 80%. I can't talk. Guys, I'm sorry. I can't talk. Is, is, 
Isn't 80% a lot? Goosebumps all over the place. I feel you, Walter. <laughs> yeah, we have to stay positive, but I'm like Walter, gotta be realistic sometimes. I'm so happy for him. Dude, I want to jump around. Now that cough is the other thing we need to discuss. Yeah, what is that? See that scary looking thing there? Yeah, that is what they saw. It's tissue inflammation. It's reaction to your radiotherapy. This episode was genius. The way they fooled us. You probably have a tear in your esophagus from the coughing and that can be very serious. You could rupture and bleed to death. Doctor, I hope you're right about everything. With something like this, you have to call me immediately. Okay. I will, from now on. But for now, I'd say that you folks have earned some celebrating. Yeah, we're having a party. I don't even care. The next episode has to be a party. Oh my god. Calm down. Why are you doing that? I guess. That's all I can say. What a roller coaster this episode was. So many lows and some pretty amazing highs. Just another genius episode. Well, that's to be expected. This show always delivers. I love how this turned into a survival show for this episode. I just knew that things were going too well. Something had to go wrong. Like really wrong. But I didn't expect it to be this crazy. The middle of nowhere can be scary. If we're gonna do this again, I feel like we have to be better prepared. And Walter, please don't leave the preparation to Jesse. By this point, you should know his strengths and weaknesses. Oh, and don't get me started on Skinny Pete. Were the instructions bad? Or is he just useless? Maybe a combination of both, if I'm gonna be honest. Anyway, the most important thing is that Walter is doing better. And that we're about to make some big money. I feel like it's time to organize another meeting with Saul. A change of plans. We're going big and I bet he'll love it. But let's be cautious as well because you know what this means. We are about to step on some toes and you know what guys? One of my favorite parts in this show is Walter and Jesse arguing. It's hilarious. The things they say to each other are too funny. It's nice to see them getting along as well but it's just so entertaining seeing them go at each other. I want to call this a perfect episode. The way they had me fooled with the cancer part, how they reversed it on us. Yeah, that was pretty spectacular. Even I wanted to celebrate there at the end. But I suppose that's it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you don't know what to watch next, here's a video I'd recommend. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. I'd much appreciate it. Thank you.